All right, welcome back to more Detroit Become Human. You guys are awesome. Uh, been able to make a lot of videos thanks to PlayStation giving me the game early. And uh, so thank you guys for just each video killing it. And uh, with that being said, guys, keep it up if you want multiple parts each day. All right, let's do this. What is this? Oh, this is just adding to the extras. Beeline disaster. Gossip Weekly. I'm gonna go back and read all this once, uh... Once I go back to edit all this. Alright, so now what? Uh, we, I mean, we need the clothes, right? So, how else do we get them? Can I just ask the guy, yo, can I have the clothes? No, I guess not. I'm not gonna stop. I mean, I don't want to ruin my reputation with Alice since she's been through so much trauma as it is. She needs somebody that listens to her finally. All right. Um, we have the. Let me see what happens when you leave this. Come on, let's go. I'm not gonna steal the clothes yet. I might have to come back and get them. All right, we got the motel. Let's try that. Pretty open-ended chapter right here. Probably the most open-ended one, at least. The problem is, I'm wondering if I... No androids allowed. I need to change clothes. I have to. We're not going in? We have to find $40 and get rid of this uniform. Or go somewhere else. All right, just hang on. Uh, let's go check the other two places first. Once we check the other two, if I don't find clothes anywhere else, I'm just gonna steal those, but... We have this little spot over here, hold on. An abandoned house. At least we'd be out of the rain. Kara, I don't like this place. I know. But it's just for one night and no one will look for us here. Alright, can cut fence here. With what? What did that say? Hold on. Hold on, let me see what the objectives are. Find clothes, get $40. Find a wire cutter. Oh man, it, uh, like the pressure is just building on right now. I love it. So we're not going to be able to cut this thing yet. Wire cutters. So we probably got to go down the other side. I wonder if there's a time limit on this chapter. I do want to explore all my options first. I would think changing clothes would be the most crucial because people are going to be looking for an android with a little girl since it's technically, I guess, considered kidnapping in a way. No, you're doing the right thing, it feels like. Sleep in the abandoned car. That's a lot of, uh, options. It's the only thing I can see to do right now is just go in here. Maybe we can find a wire cutter at least. Oh, hold on. It's a generator of some sort. Oh, it's a wire cutter. Hold on. That should be able to tear through the fence. Which now leads to get inside the car or not. What happens if you do this? It looks abandoned. Oh, God. Stand back, Alice. It's gonna please into a car alarm. There's gotta be something back here. Maybe some clothes or something. I do want to use the, I guess the cutter on the fence before we get in here. Can sleep in car now. 
But should we? It's dry inside, and nobody will find us here. I don't want to sleep in there. Can't we find a better place? All right, we're not sleeping there. Into that. Uh, keep searching. Okay. We'll find somewhere better. Can't be out here all night, though. Too da- too- too- just too dangerous. Uh, let's see. So we've unlocked the option to sleep in the car. Worst case scenario. We don't need to cut this now, do we? I guess we could. Are you all right? Yes, it's just a scratch. Be careful. Yes, she couldn't say flesh wound technically. Don't worry, we're just having a look. All right, so we're in the whole new territory back here. I am a little bit nervous. Ted to distill those clothes, but let's look in here first. Let's get all the options out of the way. Are you kidding? Oh my god. Where did she go? Are you kidding? Wait, what are you doing? Visitors. Ralph doesn't like visitors. They're nasty. They may hurt Ralph. I don't know what the humans did to you, but she had nothing to do with it. All humans want to hurt us. But Ralph won't let them hurt him again. No, he won't let them. She's just a little girl. She's not going to hurt you. Little girl? She's not a little girl. Anyway, what does that matter? Maybe she wants to hurt Ralph. We thought nobody was here. All we want is a place to spend the night. Visitors are dangerous. Look they did to Ralph. Listen, we really need some help. It would be so kind of you if you'd let us stay. You must excuse Ralph. Ralph still finds it difficult to control himself. Sometimes his fear makes him do things he regrets. Ralph has seen some hard times. He's just so scared the humans will get him again. You can stay if you want. Ralph won't hurt you. Oh man, I don't know what to do. Okay. We'll just stay the night. <laughs> come on! Why don't you put that knife come, down, fam? Come, come on! This way! Ralph has lived here since he ran away. Ralph never goes outside, so no one knows he lives here. Humans come in to squat from time to time, but, you know, Ralph just hides till he leaves. <laughs> I don't like this at all, man. There's some serial killer shit right here. You can make yourself at home here. Ralph is gonna go into the other room. He would like to stay with you. But he has things to do. It's just for one night, Alice. We'll find a better place tomorrow. Right. Let's see where you can sleep. Sit down and I'll start a fire.
That's gonna come in handy later. Make a bed, start a fire. All right. So I wonder if you steal the clothes, you get money. I'm guessing none of this is even gonna happen, so... That's kind of cool we did this one. Collect wood, okay, let's go over here. There's some stuff here. I really don't want to leave her alone. Let's make her a bed, though. Found blankets. Uh, where's the fireplace is right here, but the problem is... I gotta get matches. The thing is, I gotta go upstairs, and I don't want to leave her alone. Because if I come back down and get her hostage, then... Oh, hold on. I need wood first, hold on. So we're just putting that there. There's matches. Uh, let me collect wood first, hold on. Let's go in here. Oh man, I'm... S this is kind of nerve-wracking, yo. Let's talk to him, see what happens. RA9. What does that mean? What? Those symbols. Why are you writing that? I don't know. I don't know. I guess he doesn't have any wood anywhere. All right. Kitchen's empty. I gotta go upstairs. Problem is... Wait, what's this over here? Is this the wood? Oh, alright, we're good. I kind of want to walk upstairs, but I don't know if I have to. Let's drop this down here and see what happens. I don't think the wood's gonna burn, though. I mean... It needs to be a certain type. You can come to bed. I did what I could. It's not much, but at least you'll be warm. Oh, she needs a blanket, man. Why didn't he ever love me? Why was he always so upset with me? All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. That's why he was always so angry. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why can't we just be happy? I don't know, Alice. You'll never leave me, right? I promise you'll never go. I promise. Will we be together forever? Forever. I'm gonna lie with her. Cause I don't wanna that that guy <laughs> with the knife. I don't know, in the next room. Can we at least close the door?
All right, man, that is a big chapter, and there is a lot of uh, a lot of possibilities. So that'll make for some great down the road potential, I guess, replay value. So check it out. What we got? It's like you only experienced thirty four percent of the game the first time. So you go inside the laundromat, uh, check motel. I'm guessing if you got the money and you stole the guy's clothes. Talk to the Android trash collector. Maybe there's something else I could have done right there, because there's like a whole extra thing. I guess that's its own, because it actually has an ending right there. I don't know what happens, but I felt like this was a good choice. I mean, nothing was wrong with it. I'm guessing the other one is uh, sleep in the car. And that's what that second one is. The first one looks like it branches from the motel. Okay, so... Top one's motel. Obviously, you stay there. Car. And then... Stayed in the squat. <laughs> Watch Alice from chair. Yeah, I didn't want to leave her, so... I don't know what that bottom one is, though. That's the one thing. Because it starts at find shelter for the night. Talk to the android. So, I'm guessing when it's just... Maybe you just don't? I don't know. Something big must happen there. Anyways. What in the world? Last time we remember we got shot. Clues analyzed. Let's analyze ourselves. All right, what we got? Processing data. Impaired vision. Corrupt mine. Palace. Okay. All systems in low power mode, okay. Where's the other one at? There's two more things. Oh wow, so we can't stand because of that. Uh, what's left though? We're seeing that, maybe the hand? No? Oh wait, there's two things. There's that one and there's one at the top. Ah, right, okay, here we go. Kind of looks like the Terminator a little bit, which is kind of cool. Arnold after he fought the, uh... Got the end of the Terminator 2. Putting the pieces back together. They get some fresh legs, man. And being human is hard in this game, man. Uh, let's get that left leg going. Alright, so we can't use that one. There we go. That is the one. It's like an android graveyard right here. Alright, both legs are good to go. Slowly but surely we're gonna stand up here. 
escape the junkyard. Yo, this this part of the game It's like a horror movie almost. Is there anything behind us? No. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho! Find Jericho! Creepy and effective. It's like Silent Hill downpour all of a sudden. What the? Get off me! Where are you going? 